Hello there. I'm uh, heading out to Bashaw. I'm, uh, I'm heading out for a coffee time with the community. And as I was heading out there, I realized there's this beautiful little road that took me down here to this little bit of trees. It's gorgeous. And, um, and a field and uh, a pond. And there are some birds um, singing as well as, as the traffic behind me. It struck me, and it has been striking me a lot lately, that we spend a lot of time racing from one place to the next. We spend a lot of time not being in the moment we're in, waiting for something better to come along, waiting for, for the next moment to arrive. And I'm doing a lot of driving to the country. And what I'm coming to realize is that we need to be in the moment we're in, no matter what we're doing, not wait to get to the next thing. Although we are sometimes in waiting and sometimes we can feel stuck. I do sometimes. We can feel like we're in limbo. We can feel like we're in that in-between time. But really a lot of life is in between, isn't it? Lots of times people are waiting for surgeries. They're waiting because someone they love is dying. They're waiting because, um, because they, uh, someone's coming to visit or waiting for a holiday. or We just spend an awful lot of our time waiting. And the scripture reminds us to wait on God, to wait on our Lord. And I think what that can mean is if we wait on God in the present moment, we will see the little blessings right here and right now. And I think that's actually a really neat thing to remind ourselves to do. I forget all the time. And as I'm driving out to the country, I'm noticing the beautiful colors. And I'm just realizing that as I drive to get to one from one place to the next, it is incredibly beautiful. The landscape is so lovely. Could we, could we look to God as we, as we are going from one place to the next, as we are in our in-between times, as we're waiting for wherever it is we're going, could we look to God to be renewed and, and to bring us the little blessings of the present moment? The scripture says, those that wait upon the Lord will renew their strength. They will mount up on wings like eagles. They will run and not be weary. They will walk and not faint. So I'm reminded today how precious the present moment is. And so as I'm driving out to Basha, I'm gonna just really pay attention to the present moment. I'm just gonna breathe in the present moment and, um, and just, just wait on God. Just look to God for the little, the little bits of surprises, the little bits of spirit that show up. Let's pray. Lord, you call us to live our lives to the full. We live a lot of our lives in between, waiting for fall to move into winter, for winter to move into spring, spring to summer, and spring, summer back to fall. We wait for all the seasons of our lives so often, and yet, Lord, you call us to be here and now as we wait. And you promise to renew us. And I know, Lord, you are calling us to be in the present moment more often to appreciate the moment we're in and to know that you are with us in that moment and that if we wait on you, we look to you, we will find that you are there and we will be renewed. Thank you for these promises. We pray this in your name. Amen. So as we move into the next moment, I'm going to invite you to join me in being in the present moment and being in the moment you're in. And, um, and I shall try to do the same. Um, it's a process. We have a little bit of learning to do. So God bless you today. Take care. Bye now.